Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. We're gonna make a quick little drive here, uh, running FSD 13.2.9. Um, I have Jefferson in the back. Say hi, Jefferson. Hi. There we go. All right, he's gonna comment along as well as we're um, headed out here. So we're gonna make our loop here. And we're gonna head to Target running whole self driving. Jefferson, you like how the car drives itself? Yeah. What's the best part about it? So like you can steer the steering wheel all by itself. Mm-hmm. And that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool, huh? Mm -hmm. It's like a robot. Like a robot. Yep. So let's check out the where we're at here. We are running, like I said, whole self-driving 13.2.9. Um, this is the newer update as it took about three months as we've talked about in previous videos for us to get an update. Um, and now we have an update, but we're going to drive around here, see if we, the goal here, right, is to make sure I don't touch the steering wheel. Yeah. Oh, and we're slowing down there for the crosswalk. That actually might have been, that was pretty interesting. That actually was pretty interesting. Yeah. So right there, we slowed down for that crosswalk. Got people walking here as well. So we're going to get out of the neighborhood. We're going to go to Target. Yeah, Target. Yeah. Why do you like Teslas, Jefferson? Because they can drive by themselves and also when they're like driving by themselves, they can also do Rainbow Road. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Should I turn Rainbow Road on? Sure. Yeah, I don't have it on. <laughs> Always rainbows. There we go. We have Rainbow on. We have Rainbow Road on right now. Yep. That's good. We got kids up here who are selling lemonade. So lemonade. I think they want us to stop. I don't think we're gonna stop. I don't think FSD is gonna stop for them. <laughs> right? Selling lemonade on the first day of summer for you, huh? Yeah, they've been selling lemonade lemonade for a couple of days. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty neat. Yeah, pretty neat. Okay. So we're gonna make our way out of the neighborhood, head around here so see how the car handles you think i'm gonna have to take over maybe maybe we'll see eventually we'll have a wondering if this 13.2.9 update is going to be the one of the last updates until we get unsupervised fsd the idea of the robo taxi and cyber cab or whatever that are coming out eventually um according to elon musk will be soon Right, so Jefferson, there's gonna be a car, a Tesla that doesn't even have a steering wheel. Mm. Got a runner here on the road, so there we go. Make sure we didn't hit her. But yeah, it's gonna have no steering wheel. How do you think that's gonna be? Cool. That's gonna be cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. Checking the map. Oh, okay, I thought we were gonna go a dumb way. Checking the cars there on the turn, because that car's coming down that hill is pretty fast. We make it see everything on the camera. Good. Oh my god, I did fly forward. I don't have my intention monitoring, which is interesting, but it's like the say the third video I've made here on this new update. So initial impressions, and then we had the one driving through kind of the, a lot of the rain and the, the traffic. We got a, kind of a flashing yellow unprotected turn here. So we make that turn on this busy highway. There's the attention monitoring. I have to keep hitting the wheel at that point. Riding with Rainbow Road here with Jefferson. Mm -hmm. He loves the Rainbow Road. What's your favorite thing to do in a Tesla? Um, to play the games on it. Oh, there we go. The beach buggy racing game. Mm -hmm. Right? 
won all the cars on there, haven't you? Huh? Have you won all the cars on that? Yeah, I forgot all of the characters and all of the maps. I got, I got all of it. There we go. Expert Beach Buggy Racing, I think is what it's called, uh, back here in the back seat with Jefferson. So we're going to turn here. Cars are going through the light. Easy peasy right there, right? Yeah. That car's turning, so there's your big thing getting over as those cars were turning into that parking lot. But yeah, 13.2 is a pretty smooth ride. It's pretty smooth, right, Jefferson? Mm -hmm. There we go. Kind of the everybody's getting out of school for the summer. Yeah. Everybody's out for walks here. It's Friday out Friday morning still. Going to a graduation today, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then we're after, after that we're going to Top Golf. Yeah, we are going to Top Golf after that. It's gonna be fun. Yeah. Road up here is a little bit more windy, so that's always a good test. I haven't tested this version on um, on this little windy road as we go up, and then we'll go down as well um, towards the shopping center. But adjust the speed pretty well as it comes up here and goes down usually, so I'm sure 13.2.9 is going to be the same. What else do you like about Teslas, Jefferson? Um, that they can drive by themselves. Yeah, well, you already said that. <laughs> you have to put gasoline in them? Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Do you have to put gasoline in them? Gas? No. No? We just have to charge them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just have to charge Yeah, we just have to charge Tessie at home. Here we go, yeah. Yeah, we do charge it at home. That's exactly right. Up ahead here, is a, you know, we got a bunch of graduations happening up here. We'll be coming here later. So cones in the road. There it sees the cones. <laughs> it was back to getting that lane, though. So here's a good little test here, too, because you got people up here kind of directing traffic. That guy's dancing. He's into it. You see him dancing up there? <laughs> He's going for it. Right? Oops, I just hit the... You probably see that on camera. He having a good old time up there. Yeah, so this is the World Arena in front of us. Well, graduation season. We'll be here later as well, here in a little bit for a graduation. I'm sure parking is going to be fantastic. But, yeah, we kind of see as we make this turn here, There's some that lane is kind of closed so those cars can come through. Um, you get some cops up there as well that are kind of directing traffic. So as we make our way here to Target. Yeah, it yeah, it's all the wanted to get in that other turn lane, but at least all those cones took a second. But hey, there's almost, cones here, so let's see how this handles. There yeah, we we're go. also almost at Target. We are almost at Target. Here's what's funny: it's trying to get back over, and then it's gonna have to get back over. Oh shoot! I might have to take the, take over. There we go. It figured it out. I was gonna say that's a police car. So obviously something that's different that's got to get used to because they are bringing cars out of here. Right, it wants to get over because we have to turn, so we're getting over as those cars were coming out of the arena. And it was able to do it. But, yeah, we'll see. If this is the last version before we go unsupervised. I don't know, especially since that this one took about three months to come. We were stuck on 13.2.8. Um, now with the .9 here, right, kind of a minor update. So 
um, you know, are we on the on the verge of unsupervised full self driving, which will be the what we are looking for eventually, especially if Robo Taxi is coming out here pretty soon. Um, if Tesla's on that verge of launching that, then we're going to have to see if that is what happens. Okay, so we can go. Oh, oh, we're taking making a U turn. Okay. okay, let's let it do it. <laughs> that was a little weird, huh? It could have turned in right there. What? So that's a navigation issue, obviously. So I wanted to make that U turn. Did not even realize, so I let it do it. Because now we'll turn in. Even though it could have turned right there. So there's a big little, I mean, I'm sure that's a navigation hiccup um, more so than anything because it could have made that turn right there. But instead, it went down to that light, made a U turn, and then this turned into the parking lot. So I'm not sure exactly. But we'll see if it takes it to the front of the store. Maybe it'll try to park itself. That's going to be the next big thing, right? Especially on 13.2.8. Maybe it, very rare that it would actually find a parking spot on its own. Um, and it would generally just stop at the front of these stores. And so let's kind of see if that's exactly what it's going to do here. Um, or not. Anytime I've ever come here driving it, it does. It's Because, I mean, obviously the map's kind of showing where it's going to end. But there's obviously a parking lot that it can go find spots in. So that's going to be the next big piece, especially if we're going to go from point A to point B, right? Starting the car from one spot to another, you know, or from that one location to the other. Do you think it's going to find a parking spot, Jefferson? Yeah. I don't know. Let's find out. Because to me, if we're going to go unsupervised and get to that point, it's got to be able to know, especially in these types of circumstances, that it's come to, you know, a store or shopping center or whatever it is that there's parking spots that it can put itself in instead of stopping right up here, which is more than likely what it's about to do. And it's going to basically end the trip right here. But it's gonna want to. It's gonna pull right here, <laughs> versus actually just parking, which you can just park. Yep. See, no, we're not parking here, right? <laughs> well, I see. I see two parking spots. I know. Get a lot down in this road. Right. So that'll be the big thing. But that's a quick, short little drive there. So thanks for coming along for the ride. Say thanks, Jefferson. Thanks. Um, give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, and we'll see you next time. Yeah. Bye.